So here's a spicy conversation. How many of you sex with your partner, huh? Turns out more and more Americans are turning <laughs> to sexting. Oh, we have yeah, music. The music is great. Okay. Oh, or sending sexy texts as a way of expressing intimacy. We came across this article in health.com that we thought was interesting. It says nearly 70% of Americans over 18 years old admit to sending sexy messages to their, these videos, wow. oh my gosh, to their love interests. And they had some interesting tips to follow. Whoa. Okay, so first they say establish ground rules first so you know what your partner is into. Next, they say start slow by sending some words of appreciation. And finally, enjoy the tease. Think of te sexting as a way to build up the sexual tension. Also, consider pushing boundaries. Uh huh. Sexting. Look at his face. How happy he is. <laughs> boundaries push. Consider sexting as a way to suggest something you haven't tried yet but are interested in. Are we out of B roll? And be playful. Y'all need some cash. And be playful. That's great. What do you think about this, Albert? I love it. And I'll tell you why. I, I was never a serial, you know, I wasn't good at monogamy. Because, like, I was, you know, when I was a young dude Erica's coming up, face. Erica yeah. knows we had a lot I, of discussions because Erica and Jeff, you guys were like my spirit. And I was like, I want to learn how to be monogamous. And I learned that there is like some sexiness in like working on the same person. I think a lot working. of people want to have one night stands because you're new to that person. It's the first thing. So, all your tricks the first time, they're like, oh, this guy's great. But the second time, they're like, oh, you've done that before. So, I think. Kind of like working on the same person yeah. and reinventing yourself is kind of sexy. I, I, I do remember this conversation, uh, Al. We've had a lot of different conversations, and I think I told you tricks are for kids. Yes. Um, yes. Yeah. So you did. <laughs> you did. You absolutely did. Well, um, yeah, I do think it is important to have different expressions of intimacy. My husband and I, especially because he was on the road so much, um, he would travel a lot. So texting and like communication in that way, especially having had a long distance relationship for a while is really important. My husband would think I was off my rocker. <laughs> he would be like, who is this woman? You're bananas. I mean, we've been together 15 years. I guess I should start you know, spicing things up and doing that. But if I were to send him a, a, a sex right now, he would think I was bananas. Yeah, I, I think sending that music gets the point across. Yeah. You don't even need that the guy, right Just in that old guy's face. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Jeff, I think we need tonight. to save your marriage. Okay, so yeah, I do, I do. I, so I said, we had another show and I sent my wife this message during the show. And I well, said- Well, first of all, do you guys sext? No. Yeah, I know you don't. That's, yeah, no, yeah, okay. no, it's ridiculous. <laughs> um, yeah, I wrote, <laughs> I wrote, I'm going to tie you up and do a naughty dance for you, dot, 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 just to see what she would say. I thought she'd come back before no. commercial break. That was, a, that was a, an hour and a half ago. She didn't write me back. Now I feel like she's out of town, by the way. So she probably oh. thinks I'm like yep. sending it to somebody else. And I'm like, oh, my God. And now she's not even writing me back, and I'm in trouble. <laughs> She for sure, because it's so out of your wheelhouse. I would never send her something like that. So for sure, she's in North Carolina. You can't be like, doing new stuff when you're out of town, Jeff. And you're not, and you're <laughs> you are in big trouble. Do you need me to call her? Yes. Yeah. Okay. So much for that sexy her. dance. Paul <laughs> Jordan. Coming up on DBO, Steven Spielberg just inked a blockbuster deal with Netflix. So we're going to break down.